This is a T5. LED shop light. And it didn't come with any of these plugs. So I'll show you how to hook this thing up without the plugs. What you gotta do first is you pull these caps out. And these caps come out. There's these little tabs right here. Right there. And you slide it all out for all this. All right, here's the tab. You slide in, slide out. Pull the cover off. And the wiring is just sitting in here. You just slide the little LED strip out. And you just look at the circuit board right there. And you just find out which one it says AC. N and ACL. L is the low side. That's the power. That's the hot side. That's the 110 side. And the N is a neutral wire. That's all you have to do. Now, if you notice, they don't even hook up the grounds on these things. Either one is hooked up. No ground. No ground wire. Okay, so don't worry about it. It's a two wire system. Now, on this end, the two red wires. They're just a jumper wire. They're probably putting out, I'm guessing, 12 volts. So leave that end alone. The only end you have to worry about is the power end. This is where your AC comes in. So you just find out right there. Can you see that on the board where it says AC and ACL? See it next to the white wire? So that's all you do. What I'm going to do. You know, I don't have these caps. I do have a lot of these. Just your standard plug. You can use a plug, you can go, go, go direct. You can go direct with this uh, AC line. This is a standard AC line. Just make sure when you hook it up because this is a diode, it's not a light bulb. It's got to be uh, hooked up right. You can't reverse the uh, polarity or it won't light. So. LED, eliminating diode. That's all it is, is a diode. So on your plugs, you have the, uh, the big blade. That's always the ground or the neutral. The small blade, that's the hot. Look at your cord. The smooth, black or white, whatever color it is, that's your hot. And the one with the ribs on it, that's supposed to be your neutral. You can check it. Continuity checker. Continuity checker, just a buzzer. Big blade, big blade. Right there, which one was it? With the ribs. Okay. Now, make sure your outlet's wired right. Keep your multimeter, any meter. Put it on AC. AC, 200 volt. Go down to your outlet, any outlet, to make sure. Reds always your hot. Black is always your comp, your neutral or your ground on a meter. Okay. Just stick your red one in the small slot. Slip the black one, and the other side. What are we reading? See, you got 117, 118. All right, okay. Now, put the black in the, in the big blade, which is supposed to be your neutral. Touch your ground. Shouldn't get anything. That's telling you your big blade, the big slot, is tied in neutral ground. Back at the panel, that's all tied in together. Small slot, ground, there you go, you got your power. So you know the small slots are hot. Which is what? This is, okay, so our small slot is the hot. 
Okay, so to make this real simple, all I'm doing is I'm going to take these leads. I know that the uh, small slot, the rib side, again, is your uh, neutral. All right. And the line side, which is your power, is your. Uh, I'm just going to plug it in to test it. It should come on. Well, it will come on. As long as I don't make sure you don't short these things out while I'm playing with it. Yep. Okay. Done deal. Didn't need any of those special caps. Anyway, so what I'm going to do is I just have these super easy put together plugs I have in the garage. Same thing. Going to put the black in the load, load side and the white like that. I'm just going to turn it over, bend those tabs over, solder it, done. So that's it. It's pretty easy. Here's a, I'm going to get a close up on that on a piece of paper. It's probably going to be kind of weird. But, uh, but that's it. It's just LED. Simple, easy, the T8 shops. You don't need the fancy plugs. Then if you decide if you want to put the crazy plugs on there, you know, you just pull this out and put your plugs back in. And that's it. So, super easy. Done deal.